discover and play the kid you way where STEM dreams light up your day. Curious minds come join the crew. Adventure awaits at Kid U. Hello there, amazing explorers and thinkers. Welcome back to our fun and exciting world of Kid U. Today, we've got a super special topic to dive into. We're going to unravel the mystery of a word you've probably heard a lot, math. But what really is math? Let's find out together. You see, math is like a magical key that unlocks so many secrets of the world around us. It's not just about adding or subtracting numbers. It's a way of thinking and solving problems that we encounter every day. For instance, have you ever divided a pizza among friends? You were doing math. Or when you're playing and you want to see how high you can count, or how many jumping jacks you can do in a minute? That's math too. Math helps us in cool ways. It's there when we're cooking with our family. Measuring cups and spoons? That's math in action, helping us make our favorite recipes just right. And when you're saving up your allowance to buy a new toy, you're using math to plan and count your money. But wait, there's more. Math is in the beautiful patterns we see in nature, like the spiral of a seashell or the arrangement of leaves on a branch. These patterns follow mathematical rules, which is pretty awesome to think about. Now, let's talk about some math magic, addition and subtraction. When we add, we're putting things together, and when we subtract, we are taking away. Imagine you are playing a game with three of your friends at recess, and two more friends ask to play. That's five friends you're playing with. That is called addition. Then, three of them get bored and go to the swing set. Now you only have two friends to play the game with. That is called subtraction. But that's not all. There's multiplication, which is like speedy addition. It's adding the same number many times. For example, if you have five rows of chairs and four chairs in each row, you have five times four, which is 20 chairs. And then there's division, which is like sharing equally. If those 20 chairs need to be shared by five tables, each table gets four chairs. Math also helps us understand shapes and sizes. When you build with blocks, you're exploring geometry. That's a math word for the study of shapes and sizes. You learn which shapes stack best, which ones are stable, and how to build the tallest tower without it tumbling down. Even the clock on the wall uses math. Telling time involves understanding numbers and how they go round in a circle from one to 12. And when you play music and count the beats, you're using math to keep the rhythm. In math, we also find patterns, like in a song or a dance. Patterns are sequences that repeat in a logical way. Spotting patterns helps us predict what comes next, and that's a useful skill in so many areas of life. Now, imagine this. Every time you play a video game, use a computer, or watch a cartoon, math is at work behind the scenes, making all that fun possible. Programmers use math to write the code that makes games and apps. So, you see, math isn't just numbers on a page in school. It's a big, exciting world full of questions and problems waiting to be solved. It's about thinking creatively, finding patterns, and understanding our world. And the best part? Anyone can be a math magician, including you. And that's the wonderful world of math, my friends. Stay curious, keep exploring, and you'll discover just how amazing math can be. Can't wait to see you next time on KidU for more fun and learning. Bye for now, mathematicians.